In the grand tapestry of Catholic history, few individuals have left an indelible mark as profound as Pope St. Leo IX. A man of great faith and conviction, his influence on the Catholic Church continues to resonate even today. Born in the year 1002 in Egesheim, now modern-day France, he was christened with the name Bruno of Egesheim Dagsburg. Raised in a noble family, young Bruno was enveloped in the religious fervor of the time from an early age. His family's connection to the church paved the way for his spiritual journey, a journey that would lead him to the highest echelons of religious power. In the year 1027, at the tender age of 25, Bruno was appointed as a Bishop of Toul, a position he held for nearly 20 years. It was during this time that his dedication to the church and his administrative prowess truly shone, earning him respect and admiration from the clergy and the laypeople alike. The year 1051 marked a significant turning point in Bruno's life. He was elected as the Pope and took on the name Leo Thynin. It was a time of turmoil and change in the church, and Pope Leo IX rose to the occasion with a fervor that was unmatched. One of his most significant contributions was his unwavering dedication to church reforms. He was pivotal in curbing simony, the practice of buying or selling ecclesiastical privileges, and he worked tirelessly to instill a sense of morality and discipline among the clergy. However, his papacy wasn't without controversy. The year 1054 saw the unfolding of the Great Schism, a monumental event that split the Christian world into Eastern and Western factions. Pope Leo IX's role in this event, particularly his excommunication of the Patriarch of Constantinople, is still a topic of intense discussion among historians. Despite the tumultuous events of his papacy, Pope Leo the Nabin's dedication to the Church was unwavering. He was a man of faith, a man of conviction, and he believed in the power of the Church to bring about positive change. Pope St. Leo IX passed away on April 19, 1054, but his legacy lives on. His feast day, celebrated on the 19th of April, serves as a reminder of his indomitable spirit and steadfast dedication to the Catholic Church. In summary, Pope St. Leo the Dagin's life was a testament to his unwavering faith. From his early years in Egesheim to his papacy in Rome, he dedicated his life to the service of the Church. His reforms, his dedication to morality and discipline, and his role in the Great Schism have left an indelible mark on the history of the Catholic Church. Pope St. Leo IX was a man of his time, yet his influence transcends the ages. His life and works serve as a beacon, guiding the faithful towards a path of righteousness and devotion. Please subscribe to Catholic News World's YouTube channel. Thanks and God bless.